All right, so one clean mat. This is actually not clean buster at the moment. I had a bottle of wheel and tire cleaner that was sent to me to test. I think from the Black Line, from John McKnight's Black Line collection. And one of the bottles were leaking, so I went ahead and dumped it into the IK uh, foamer because it was empty and needed a refill. So I thought I'd try it in the IK foamer. But what I wanted to try, kicking off this video, is this is Swift in uh, this here uh, IK sprayer. This was my natural finish, finish bottle before we got the minis. So now the minis, that's where my natural finish is. So I threw Swift in this, and I wanna try it. It's kind of a, kind of a protectant, these floor mats, see if it slicks them up or see if it, how good of a finish it gets on them. Normally I would let them air dry, but today we're gonna speed up the process. So it's not completely dry yet, but leaves it, of course, fresh dress looking good. We'll uh, see if it dries completely, if it's slick or anything. But so far, so good with Swift on floor mats. Thought that might be a pretty good alternative use for it. We'll set it there to air dry. But anyway, with this main vid, what the main point of this video is about is it's been one year, a little over it. April 2nd was the one year mark for the Stoner Invisible Glass glass coating. So uh, this is uh, the first time I could wash it in April. And as you can see, it's pretty filthy. Lots of bugs, chunks, all that good stuff. Got some, uh, had some dust on the hood. It had a light rain. It was supposed to do a heavy rain. But instead it was a light rain, so it's kind of got some weird water spots on there looking bad, looking rough. So we need to do this, uh, give it a quick wash. And then we're gonna check up and see if stoners survived a year see if anything's left the wife did comment that in march that it was about time to reset this glass coating so that's the first time she said that so about a year seems to be right on the money for the stoners invisible glass ceramic glass coating so let's give this a quick wash uh, i'm going to try an alternate use for defender as well and uh, let's check it out So as you saw, extra flat water behavior on the telly wheel. So we're gonna hit it with some Inspiration Defender and see what happens. We're gonna let this soak in a couple seconds. Let it work some magic. All right, let's hit it with the pressure washer, see what happens. There you go, getting some pretty good water behavior. So pretty good alternate use for Defender, especially on wheels, spray and rinse. Tactic, worked pretty good. Now, how long is this gonna last? I'm not sure, we'll have to see. Next time I wash this thing, see if Defender's still sticking around. There you go, pretty good instant results with the spray and rinse method with Inspiration Defender. Now, as comparison, we just cleaned this wheel. We have some DIY detail quick beads left, which is, this is its intended purpose, where Defender, that's not its intended purpose, but it worked pretty good. But let's compare to quick beads real quick. Let that soak in a couple seconds. You can see it gets to work pretty aggressively, pretty fast. 
and let's see some results. Really tight water boat beating with quick beads as expected as this is, is its intended purpose. I love using stuff like this for wheels. Let's go check out Defender side again. But you can see, not bad from Defender as well. I'd say water beads aren't quite as tight, but definitely works over here on the Defender side. So if you don't want a designated product like Quick Beads, Defender looks like it'll get the job done for you as well. As we get in here close, you can see some. Pretty close. But like I said, Quick Beads intended for it, gonna be a little bit better, but definitely a good alternative use for old Defender. And if you wanna know where to get great products like Swift and Defender and the Stoner's Invisible Glass Ceramic Glass Coating, you can go check out the link below at the Cleaner Stash. Promo Jamie Tin will save you 10%. You can find great brands like PNS, Phoenix EOD, Oberk, Buff Right, Proper Detail Brushes, Go check them out. Those proper detail brushes are hot. Great price, high quality, and they're brushes that you can actually put the work in. They're not just going to be sitting around just doing stuff. You know what I mean? And there you go. Go check it out. Link in bio. Promo J. Mateen. All right. Let's get some pre-rinse action. There you go, pretty much flat as a pancake, but you can see it's starting to fight off. So we'll give it a wash, see what's going on. Whew, this thing's dirty. You can see even the Diamond Protex having a hard time. whole car just has this dirty rain film all around it. All right, rinse off time. Let's get the rinse off, see what's going on. Stoners, invisible glass, ceramic glass coating at over 12 months.
And don't forget we increased the GPM lately, so we're dumping a lot more water on these surfaces as well. As you can see, after a year, it's easily still going strong. Definitely, you know, if the wife's starting to tell you, time for a reset, it's time to take it off, throw something new on there. But, I mean, it's still going. That was Citron in the foam cannon, so degreased everything, so no toppers or nothing like that. Could be left off, Citron, very strong soap. But there you go, folks. That's uh, like uh, one year and three weeks or so. One year, two weeks. One year, two weeks, I believe. So, easily has held up to the one year claim. Great job over uh, at the folks at Stoner. Really good product. But I am going to strip it off. Uh, maybe today I might just top it off with Defender and call it good for a while. And then uh, let me know the next glass coating you want to see tested. And we'll throw that bad boy on here. So I'll, uh, or if you want to see Defender, how Defender goes on glass, let me know and we'll strip this off good. Maybe just Defender the whole car and see how Defender does by itself. Let's check up on the Dime and Protect. Still doing its thing. Still doing its thing, looking pretty good. Like I said, we're dumping a lot more water on the surfaces now. So this is our swift mat a little while later it's dry doesn't feel slick at all definitely missed some spots yes i know this is my mat so who cares super fast losing daylight that kind of deal but anyway doesn't feel slick at all so it uh, looks pretty good besides the areas that i missed and uh yeah i'd say that's success swift as a mat dresser worked pretty dang good and there you go, folks. That's going to wrap up uh, this video. That was a uh, over one year update on Stoner's Visible Glass Coating. Looking good. We got the diamonds on there still doing their thing. We got a uh, Defender alternate use. We had Swift alternate use. Jam-packed video. Good stuff. And if you want to know where to find all these beautiful products, or most of them anyway, you can go check the cleaner stash. I'll have them all linked in there. Promo Jamie 10 will save you uh, 10%. All that good stuff. And help support the channel best way the only way go check it out but uh stoner great job exceeding that one year mark excellent product and that's all i got on this one because we're losing that daylight everybody so i'll catch you on the next one till then stay clean